Play surges forward. Possibility. EA Sport. It's in the game. Legendary, Dave. That intro, absolutely legendary. What are we playing today on Old School? Well, it's a game that we've talked about so many times. We've made reference to it. It's about time we finally did it. It's FIFA International Soccer on the Super Nintendo. Ah, oh, this game. This, this game. This game. This game. This, just this, this game. game. That's it, guys. That's the video. Join us next <laughs> week for more old school this game. Um, <laughs> this is one of the better, ver one of the best versions, in Dave and I's opinion, of the original FIFA. The SNES version is like putting on your silk slippers of an evening, if you own any sl silk slippers. <laughs> We're going to play some uh, Exhibition. We will. Yeah, think, that's right. I think you're going to have to control it, Dave. Okay, that's interesting. Press start to play. Yeah. Oh, we get some teams. Here we go. We'll go as Mike's team. We always go as Italy because we that's Mike's team. Let's do it. There they are. I, Who should we play against? Yeah, I just, I, anyone. I just hope my uh, controller's working. So. We'll soon find out because on this <laughs> screen here... Yes, there we yeah. are, guys. Oh, France. Oh, yeah, no. Oh, I'm in the middle. <laughs> no. <laughs> Luckily, I can go to control setup. Dave, what have you done? Oh. We'll this, get there eventually, awesome. guys. There you go. Dave's Listen having to that. <laughs> Dave's having technical problems. <laughs> Listen to that music. It's so good. It's awesome. Right, here we go. Let's play. All right, okay. Let's see what this is about. I haven't played this since God knows when. Here we go. Now, the thing about oh, this version this that differs from some of the other versions is you notice in the top left the power bar that comes up when we play a pass. You'll yes. see it in a second when Mike plays a pass. That's different because in the other versions of this game that I've got and I've played, there's no power bar. And I like That's the power right. bar, as silly as it sounds. Um. Yeah, you you need it, you, but you need it. it helps you basically. Um, yeah, it does. There we go. Oh, this still feels amazing to play. Right, I just got to get used to it. Yeah, because it is quite quite fast and quite frenetic. But yeah, it's the controls that you've got to get used to. Oh, oh, ah! oh is it the post? Is it, is it the, the beans? beans on toe? <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, this version for me, it looks also the best in my opinion, and it plays really, really well. And the sound. The only thing I would say, yeah, oh, the sound, the sound, the snare sound chip, like we always say. Yeah. The, but the, I was going to say the only thing I would say, have a go. Oh. Um, is this game with this camera angle or this view is difficult to play co-op? Yeah, it is. Because it's keeping um, yourself because... on the screen and getting the passes off. Oh, keeper. Because I play all my single play. Oh no. I play all my single player footy games this view now, guys. Broadcast. I always do. I love it. I love it for the authenticity. Yeah. But if I was playing with Dave, I wouldn't select this out of choice, would we? We'd select something where we could see far more of the pitch. It'd be like a telecam, so a sideline view rather than a sort of isometric. This is fantastic, right? It is. Absolutely awesome. Oh, here we go. What is pass? Is it A for on me, my series controller? For you, it'd be A. Yeah, for me, it's X. Yeah. Do you have to hold it down or just tap it? I can't remember because I'm hold, not getting hold my it down. off. Hold it down. Oh, because that's you, why then. Because if you tap it, they basically knock it on in front of themselves. Oh, it's a goal. oh what a goal! What a goal! <laughs> <laughs> oh, this always used to crack me up. Oh, is it the clown? <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> is it this game? No, I was thinking of Striker on striker. the side. You've got the dodgy clown that bounced the cross on the uh, Family Fortune screen. That's the one. <laughs> or at least I thought it was a clown. It might have been a strange-looking person. Yes. Yeah, I remember that very well. Oh, oh what a ten. goal! What a <laughs> goal from France! Um, goal. This game, this game, when it came out, guys, um, I my mum bought it for my birthday because, well, because I loved football gaming and the World Cup USA was on at the time. So having this game whilst that tournament was going on it's just like watch a match run upstairs play the fixture you just watched on tv it was so cool love that and i used to do that with football games as well when i had them on various systems i remember doing yeah. it with actual soccer too you know england were playing in a world cup yeah. tournament and i'd pick do exactly what you did and pick those teams and play those games 
Yeah, it was cool. Because we didn't have a lot of games with this kind Oh, you're in. Oh, you're no. in. He's Go. in. He's in. Go. Oh! Oh! Um, <laughs> this, the this, I, this I always thought was a bit dodgy. The little square on the top left showing my player's feet. It's let's say, very, very <laughs> odd. Um, anyway, let's go for that guy. It's just to make oh, sure nice. that you know that you're taking a corner. Oh, oh good save. <laughs> and he's got another corner. Right, let's get to my friend there. Charge up a little bit. There he goes. Oh. <laughs> Brilliant. I hope this you don't mind so my good. Gary Neville screaming, guys. Um Yeah, this is this is really good, mate, isn't it? It's a really good so, game. Here so we go, good. charge up. Oh, oh. <laughs> Let's try and play a pass. There he is, he's on the edge of the box. He goes for goal! Oh because the goalkeepers in this as well, the animations on them they were they were so cool. Like you really felt like <laughs> Well, <laughs> when, when you took a long shot and the keeper tipped it over the bar, you really felt like you were in a match, you know? It, it, it had that one more extra go, like, I want another game uh, feeling, which FIFA hasn't always had. No, absolutely. And I'm glad you mentioned animations because on the back of the box, I think it might be the Amiga version, the worst version, it actually talks about the animations and it shows you some of the frames of animation on the back of the box. It's really cool. Oh, wow. Really, really cool. Yeah, that is cool, actually. So here we go. Second half is about to kick off. So um, the Genesis Mega Drive version, I played first because a guy... <laughs> guys, you must hear me say this so many times, and Dave says it on, on Retro Football Series. A guy up the street had this <laughs> console, had this game. It's true. It is, it's, yeah. Honestly, that's what it was like in the 90s. Like, And for you guys watching this who are our age, you will know. But that's what it was like. It was always a kid up the road who had an Amiga there was a kid around the corner he had a Spectrum it's a, but anyway <laughs> I digress um, there was a guy who lived around the corner and he had a Mega Drive and he had this because yeah. it was on the Mega Drive first wasn't it before this it was yeah it was on the Mega Drive first that was the first version of this game and um, I couldn't stop I really couldn't stop playing that I used to be like can we just go in your house please and play some <laughs> more FIFA and he's like no my mum just doesn't like you very much I'm like why <laughs> Because uh, you're always coming around <laughs> wanting to play FIFA. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh! Hi, Mum. Bye, Mum. I'm playing FIFA. <laughs> yeah. Your, your friends just use you for your Mega Drive. To be fair, looking back, she was right, but... Oh! oh. Harsh. <laughs> nah, we loved him. He's a good guy. He was a good guy. Um, yeah. But I, I was always like, I need a Mega Drive for this game. But then... This is a long-winded story, guys. I'm sorry, but I'm getting excited. <laughs> My um, grandparents bought me the SNES, but obviously there was no football game for a while. I think we had Super Soccer. Yeah. Not much else. Sensi? <laughs> may may Sensi have had kickoff. Yeah. May have had kickoff before this. I can't remember the. Oh! Go. I can't remember the timeline. But when this came out, when I saw this sitting on the shelf in Toys R Us, oh man, and got it home, I was like. My friend came round and he played this after I'd spent so many, you know, weeks, months playing it on his Mega Drive. And he was like, it's better. This yeah. just feels better. It does, yeah. It feels a better game. It's a smoother game to play. It's better to look at, which I know sounds funny to say about a 16-bit version, but it does. And the sound, the crowd sounds on this, it sounds like proper captured sound from a game rather than <sighs> that's been generated by a sound chip. I agree. Yeah, yeah. I agree. Oh. Like that there, um, the crowd reaction, that, oh, it sounded really good. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely been sampled for the snares, isn't it? I think it has, yeah. Go for goal! I, I love that weighty feeling of the shooting in this. Yeah, same as. The ball feels quite good on this. It does. I, I was just going to say as well, I think this feels a bit more responsive than the Mega Drive version. Yeah, I'd agree with that. It's a little bit, it's a little bit slicker than the Mega Drive version. Yeah, it's a bit snappier. I keep yeah. doing that tap in front of me that you were saying. Yes, yeah, so you've got to hold that pass button down for sort of a fraction of a second, and it will just charge <laughs> up. Although you can always always do a, a fancy overhead kick if you're Dave. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! Boop down the field. There we go. I'm going full Sam Allardyce here. There he is. Shoot. He's got a chance for goal. Oh, great save! 
if if I had a criticism for this game, it would be that the CPU, the AI stands off you a little bit too much and lets you pull off that long shot. Yeah, it does. It gives you way too much time and space to do it. But then we're giving MF oh. loads of space. <laughs> what a nice little move from France there. Here we go. We're getting absolutely battered. <laughs> yeah, this is tough. It, it, it's tough going back to these old football games when you're so conditioned to the newer football games. Yeah, I totally but, agree. Um, because the controls are completely different, as you say. The perspective is different. Yeah, I, I am struggling with this camera angle, I've got to say, in this. Yeah, plus it's also remembering to select the player and getting yourself on screen. When you know when you do single player, that's not so much of an issue. It's you, rather. But when you're playing well, co-op, it is. What is select player? Because I've just been pass ignoring button. it. I'm just like... You pass button. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, so you'll see, you'll see my red star will flash around the screen as I'm trying to select a player. There you go, I was trying it then. And we've lost 4-0. Um, before we end this video, that was another thing, if I had a criticism, <laughs> was <laughs> the stars around the feet, those big flashing things. I I'd rather just have a nice little marker above the head. I it doesn't need to be such a thing. Yeah, I'd have, I'd have just had a little circle or something, not a massive grip, big triangle. Yeah. yeah. But look at the uh, stats there, guys. France had 18 shots on goal. They scored four times. That was FIFA International Soccer on the Snares. It's fantastic. It's good to play it again. We'll speak to you all soon. Take care.